So if you really want to become fluent in English, all the universe, everything will help you to achieve it. You will find the right video. You will find the right book. You will find the right application. You will find the right person for learning English. Okay. Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to share five, six or seven books, English books for reading. Okay. I will share novel, motivational book, an English practice book, grammar book, uh, pronunciation book, sorry, not pronunciation, vocabulary book. So stay with me. Okay. And let's subscribe my channel. The first book I read in my life outside my academic books so the first book was a novel. I love novels. I read a few uh, novels of my native language, that is Bengali. And uh, the first novel, the first book I read it was The Alchemist by Paulo Coelho. The Alchemist was the first book, English book that I read in my life. It was like three or four years ago. And it was my first book in English. And I love this book. I can read this book again and again and again. You know, I was like, uh, I finished that novel in just uh, five or six days. I was like too curious or excited. Like what will happen next? What will happen next? Because it's like amazing adventure and uh, motivational. The lines, the quotes are so amazing. Uh, there is a quote from uh, that book. I wrote it on a paper and then I put it on my wall. When you want something, all the universe conspires in helping you to achieve it. Think, this is so amazing and there are so many beautiful, amazing quotes. Uh, the words are like priceless. And if you read that book, you will find like, you can do anything, you can achieve anything. So it's like a dream come true book. So if you really want to start, okay? And it's, it's for anyone, beginner, intermediate, higher, um, like all the words are very easy to understand and you will understand everything. It's a, it's a story of a boy called Santiago and uh, he's from, I think, Brazil. And uh, he went to Egypt, pyramid, yes. Or, no, I'm not going to tell this story because it's a great story. And you will find this story. I know everyone will love this novel. So you can start. You can start with this novel, The Alchemist by Paulo Coelho. Okay? Next is, it's like a kind of motivational, self-help book. Okay? The book is The Power of Positive Thinking. Is the author <gasps> I forgot okay I'll put this uh, put it here okay you can see this um, this is the cover of the book and the writer is here I forgot the name of the writer the power of positive thinking this is the name of the book okay so you can start if you really want to think positively okay all the time you can read this book and also you can listen the audiobook uh, there are all the books, I think, available in audiobooks. If you don't have time, so you can listen the audio. Uh, YouTube, you can just go YouTube uh, and then write The Power of Positive Thinking. Uh, and you will watch, sorry, you will listen the whole book in audio version. Whoever doesn't like to just read so you can start. And then next is Atomic Habit. Unfortunately, I didn't write any name of the author, but you can see Atomic Habit here, right? Atomic Habit by, I forgot all the author name. If you are a lazy person, if you are like me, <laughs> if you do all the procrastination, like, okay, I will do that tomorrow, I will do that tomorrow, maybe I'll do that later. So if you are like this kind of person uh, and you want to build uh, your habit, a good habit, healthy habit, okay, productive day. If you want to spend your day productive, you can read this book, Atomic Habit. And this is a great book. Uh, in this book, there are so many strategies that you can follow for build your habit. 
for example i don't want to wake up early and i don't want to go to uh jogging what do i do you wake up every day correct and then you brush your teeth and then you maybe you eat your breakfast so what you have to do you can say okay before i eat my breakfast i have to do at least 30 minutes exercise or i have to walk for 30 minutes and then if when I get back, then I can breakfast. Without 30 minutes of exercise or 30 minutes of walk, I can't eat my breakfast. So that's how you can build your habit. So this is one point from Atomic Habit. So these are the books that you can read. So these are the three books. One is for uh, the novel, Amazing Adventure. Second one is like self-help book, Thinking. You have to think positively, then you can do positive things. You can achieve anything. And then the third one is Atomic Habit. And the third, fourth one is if you want to have uh, a book for learning grammar, for learning vocabulary, for your punctuation. So these are the books the best. So I will put the cover page here with the writer name here. So you can see the book name and the writer. Uh, the name of the book is English for Everyone English Grammar. English for Everyone English Grammar. If you go to YouTube, you will find this book. You can download the, uh, this book PDF and then you can read. This is actually the best book that I ever found for English Grammar. If you are a beginner, you don't know anything, this book will tell you all the details, everything. What is the? What is is? What is that? What is verb? Like, this is the best book. If you don't understand grammar, oh my God, this is so hard. I don't know how to understand all the grammar rules. But if you see these pages, you can see these pages here. So this is the best book I ever found. So I recommend this book like 100%. Okay, next book is English for Everyone, same author. It's vocabulary, okay? If you want to learn vocabulary for, from books, so this is the book, English for Everyone Vocabulary. Last one is, if you are like me, like you want to see, and then you can learn, or actually this is like a beginner level, okay? Uh, if you want to learn vocabulary and punctuation as a beginner level of English, so this is the book visual guide to grammar and punctuation you can see like colorful uh, pictures and the words vocabulary amazing so i recommend these books and uh, the last one is it's it's for english speaking okay if you want to follow some strategies some rules for speaking okay then you can follow this book and this book is called how to speak english fluently by hanif so you can see the cover page here and the name here you can download from google you just write the name of the book and the author and write free pdf download and then maybe you can download these books because i actually have these books soft copy these are the seven books actually seven books three for uh, self-help books and uh, three for uh, English grammar and vocabulary and one for speaking. If you have any question, please write on the comment box, okay? If you have already read the book, The Alchemist, write on the comment box. So write one quote from this book. If you already read this book, The Alchemist, because you know, this is my favorite book, <laughs> yes you know this secret too my favorite book the alchemist by paulo coelho uh, and that that was my favorite quote when you want something all the universe conspires in helping you to achieve it like all the universe is actually helping you to achieve something so if you really want to become fluent in english all the universe everything will help you to achieve it you will find the right video you will find the right book you will find the right application you will find the right uh, dictionary you will find the perfect person for learning english okay so that's it for today thank you so much for watching the full video write the comment 
if you have read The Power of Positive Thinking or Atomic Habits, so which book you think is the best of these three? The Alchemist, The Power of Positive Thinking or uh, Atomic Habit, okay? You know, uh, I will make a video of your comment. So I will read all the comments and then I will answer all your questions, okay? So write on the comments if you have any question, okay? Thank you. And uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my video, share my video and... Uh, and you can join my English speaking community on Facebook. That's free for uh, practicing daily your English and for uh, practicing with other people uh, in a meeting. Okay, Zoom meeting. So thank you so much and uh, happy learning. See you soon. See you very soon. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Take care.